Good evening. A BBC investigation has revealed there's a chronic shortage of medical equipment across the West, which could help save the lives of children who have severe allergies. Parents say they're unable to get hold of EpiPens or similar devices which give patients a sharp shot of adrenaline. If you were having an anaphylactic shock and struggling to breathe, you would inject this EpiPen into your thigh. It can only be used once. But there's now a global shortage and it's almost impossible to get your hands on one of these pens. Now there are two smaller companies who also make auto injector pens, but with a huge rise in demand, they're now struggling to cope. And schools are right to be concerned, with 17% of fatal allergic reactions happening to children while at school. Uh, inside, then, uh, it's labelled for the student, and that would be it. The secondary in Bristol has refused pupils until they brought in their correct medication. We had a student with, um, who has an EpiPen who was due to transfer from another school um, and we wouldn't allow him to start until we knew that we had that EpiPen on site in school because of course we have to take responsibility for his care while he's here um, and that did delay his start to school. And they say they'd be concerned to keep teaching a student if the EpiPen was out of date. 